The category is runway. Mark my words. Vogue will make a star. And what's newer than an entire world undiscovered? Run into the realm with guts and raw talent. This season of Pose is about the community now finding a place in mainstream, about acknowledgement, about visibility. We are on the cusp of a revolution. You're about to go mainstream. Let's vogue like Paris! And it's 1990. There are new types of dance moves that come into play. There's a lot of, you know, proactive things that are happening. We dive a little deeper into the AIDS epidemic and what happened within the 90s. I've been to three funerals this week. Three? Where's the cure? We quarantined the ones that died of AIDS, don't want them infecting anyone else. But they're already dead. Sweetie, we don't know how this thing is spread. Pose is touching on the AIDS epidemic and the HIV crisis that was happening in a very important way. This Sunday's protest up at St. Patrick's Cathedral is an even more crucial step in starting a global conversation around HIV and AIDS. We should all be going to that church for the protest on Sunday, together, as a house. Pray tell is now joining the fight for equality and rights. Blanca is someone who has been, you know, sentenced with HIV, and she has to advocate for the people out there who have it as well. To Mother Blanca Evangelista! <laughs> Story has evolved in ways where Blanca grows, her kids are thriving under her, and now she has a place of her own to actually build and come into herself. I saw this advertisement for a modeling contest. I'm not the face they're looking for. I ain't no model. You got the look. Angel's role in season two. She's trying to like move forward in her life. And like I think this is where Blanca's influence in her life comes in comes in handy. And you next day, man. No more Saturdays sitting around the house reading dirty magazines from three until five. You're gonna be teaching a voguing class down at the YMCA. They don't have a voguing class. Well, they do now. For Damon, you'll see what it means to be a 20 year old and how the culture, how the vibe, how what's happening in America with LGBTQ people, how that materializes on a young queer black body. I don't owe you an explanation for anything. I am not a slum rat like the rest of you whores. <laughs> Electra goes through a lot. She lost everything and she was taken in, but she's not the type of woman that, you know, follows anyone else's rules. In this season, she has to find herself and she discovers that she still is this strong Electra. Season two is all about people learning how to express themselves and really not giving a damn if anybody doesn't like it. Why are you pulling stunts? We're making an entrance. You about to get that poor facelift, bitch. I've come prepared to gut you like the fish you'll never be. We're telling this story so you realize that there needs to be change, that we need to continue trying to change things. I'm joining your house. Season two thrusts us and everybody to wake up. There's no more time for anything else. We're black and we're brown and we're queer. They don't give a shit about us. So we better start caring about ourselves. Show up for your lives. Wake up!